Since your market share variance, the market size variance says you use the actual size versus the budgeted size. We know it's a bigger market. And you multiply that by what you budgeted your market share to be, 20%. And then you use that weighted average contribution margin. And that is 48,000 favorable. Not a surprise. The market size was growing. You expected to make more money. So you have the 78,000 or whatever that was, 74,000 unfavorable, the 48,000 favorable. They don't offset each other completely, right? They add up to your quantity variance, which was a negative 26. This is just another way to get at those same numbers, 48,000. So just to, to, to wrap this up, this 48,000 favorable, going backwards now, 74,000 unfavorable, will add up to 